Thomas and Friends, based on the railway series by Reverend W. Audrey, created by Britt Allcroft, read by Mark Morahan. Welcome to the island of Sodor, a small magical island surrounded by sparkling bright blue sea. It has fields of green and sandy yellow beaches, castles to explore and bustling docks where giant cranes lift and load cargo from large ships. There are also lots and lots of railway lines where engines work hard to deliver goods and passengers to their destinations. Today's story is about Thomas the Tank Engine, a small blue engine with six small wheels, a short stumpy boiler, a short stumpy dome, and a short stumpy funnel. He was not the biggest engine on Sodor, but had a big heart and wanted to prove what a really useful engine he could be. Thomas's job was to fetch coaches and goods trains for the big engine. But Thomas dreamed of pulling his own coaches on his very own little branch line. Thomas was a cheeky little engine. One day, he found Gordon, the big blue engine, resting on a siding and thought it would be fun to play a trick on him. <whistles> Whistled Thomas loudly. Wake up, lazy bones. Do some hard work for a change. Gordon woke up startled. He decided to teach little Thomas a lesson. The next morning, Thomas pushed Gordon's coaches into the station as usual. Gordon called for his passengers to get on board. The signal went down and the guard waved his green flag. Gordon started so quickly, he forgot to uncouple Thomas from the back of the train. Faster and faster they went as Gordon raced out of the station. Stop! Stop! cried Thomas. Soon, poor Thomas was going faster than he had ever gone before. At last, they stopped at the station. Oh, yes. Well, little Thomas, chuckled Gordon, now you know what hard work is, don't you? And from that day on, Thomas was careful never to be cheeky to Gordon again. <laughs>